It's a new month and a new issue of Raleigh Magazine. Raleigh Magazine editor, chief, all things Raleigh Magazine extraordinaire, Gina Stevens, joining us uh, today. And Gina, it's always a pleasure. Thank you for being here. Thanks, Bill. All right, so let's start talking about the cover because there's a very special meaning behind this cover. There is. This month's cover is what we like to call Raleigh's Good Place. It's it's a place at the Table Cafe. Um, most people have heard of it, but they're not quite sure they understand the concept. Um, it, Maggie Kane opened it in 2018 as a pay what you can diner. The concept is those of us that go who can pay, pay, and then possibly pay it forward buying a token for a meal for someone who can't afford it. Um, and let's be clear, this isn't a soup kitchen, it's a cafe for all. The food's delicious and beautiful, as you can see on the cover, and their chef, Andrew, is amazing. He's a perfect fit. In addition to his culinary talent, he has a psychology degree, so he wow. really has an understanding of how to work with the community. Um, they've been through some hard times because when COVID hit, the needs of the community really changed. Um, they, for the last couple of months, they've been serving 300 meals a day, mostly to people who can't pay. So 10 days ago, they closed their doors to sort of reboot um, and get back to their original mission. So breaking news, I found out last night, they're reopening Wednesday, October 14th. But the reality is for a place at the table to succeed and, and complete its mission, we have to support it. Um, they're like a lot of restaurants. Their dining room isn't open, um, but you can do takeout, family meals to go. They'll cater anything you need. Um, if we support them, then they can take care of the community around us. Um, and 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 let's face it, it's the best biscuit in Raleigh. <laughs> I was going to say, I remember, you know, they they redid. Uh, the dining room, we were down there when they reopened, and their breakfast food alone is oh. incredible. I remember cinnamon rolls the size of my head. So, exactly. you know, that I, I'm, I'm thrilled that we have a restaurant like this. I certainly hope the community will, like you said, get back. People have been very generous before. We need to keep that momentum going forward. Absolutely. Hey, speaking of keeping momentum going forward, we all know this has been, you know, a rough year for the restaurant industry. So Raleigh Restaurant Week, kind of takes on a whole new meaning this year. It really does. You're right. They've had a horrible year, and many restaurants have had to close. So this re rest year's Restaurant Week is really a Kickstarter for dining downtown and to help restaurants get back on their feet. And it's a great opportunity for us to show some love to them. And even if you're not feeling like you want to go inside a restaurant, you can do takeout, gift cards. Um, and this year, they're doing something pretty special that is beautiful. They did it last Saturday, and they'll do it this Saturday. They are closing Fayetteville sections of Fayetteville Street. They've put tables in, strong, beautiful lights. You can pick up food from anywhere downtown, come over, sit under the lights, socially distanced, have a nice meal, um, and support some of our best restaurants in Raleigh. Um, we want them to still be there when all of this passes and we can get back inside. I absolutely, and you know, one of the great things that I love about Restaurant Week last week, it's a chance to go and try restaurants that you may not normally visit, and you can discover one that you love. Um, Gina, if, uh, you know, we love Raleigh Magazine. If somebody wants to uh, subscribe, how do they go about doing so? Well, it's it's super easy. You go on RaleighMagazine.com, RaleighMag.com. It's a $10 subscription. We mail it directly to your house. And if you subscribe in the next couple of days, we'll mail you this uh, Place at the Table uh, cover story issue. So, um, yeah, that, it's really easy to get. Get on the ball. Gina, always appreciate it. And uh, we look forward to seeing you next month. Great. Thanks, Bill. Thank you.